Hey guys, um, I'm going to explain to you your assignment today. It's pretty simple. Um, first off, you're going to go into your Google Slides. You know how to get there because you've done a ton of them. When I click on when I click on owned by anyone here, I can see all the stuff that you've done. It's crazy how much you guys have sent me. Um, but you're going to start a new one. I'm going to go ahead and click on the one that I have started. I bet you're going to give me a title on this one. Let it load for just a second. Your title is going to say symmetry, but I also want you to include your name on it. So when I do look at it, when I click on uh, owned by anyone, if it just says symmetry, I don't know who it belongs to. So put symmetry and then put your name. Jackson, that's me. Okay, so what you're going to do is you're going to you're going to do some slides on symmetry in nature. Okay, symmetry in nature. So you're going to find some pictures for me that look like uh, something from nature okay so animals plants um flowers i guess those are plants um or honestly i don't care if you want to do buildings and stuff like that just like stuff out in the real world okay food uh you can do that um things that have symmetry involved okay so what i have here is this big old blue bird it's not a blue jay i don't know what this bird is um but it is definitely symmetrical He's got a wing on this side, a wing on this side. He's got the tail. If I split it down the middle, there's, I mean, both sides look almost identical. Okay, so if I was to imagine folding this bird in half, which don't do that in real life, but if I folded this bird in half, the wing tip will touch the wing tip, the tail will touch the tail. Everything will fold symmetrically, okay? And so you're going to find that. And then what you're going to do for me is you're going to draw that imaginary line. So I'm going to come up here to line. And I'm just going, I just want a line, okay? And I'm going to draw that line through the middle of it. So what I have here is a vertical line of symmetry through this bird. Remember that line of symmetry is just imaginary, okay? When I have this line highlighted, I can click on line weight if I want to and make it thicker. Um, I can uh, I can make them with dashes. Uh, I, I can do that. Main thing you just need to do is just make it make it thicker, okay? So there's my line. All right, next thing I want you to do is I want you to draw a text box and you're gonna tell me, there we go. You're gonna tell me how many lines of symmetry you have. And so I'm gonna say uh, one vertical line of symmetry. Okay, change the color of that because it is very dark on here. Let's see, what would show up good on this dark background? Where's my colors? That's a fill color, text color, there we go. Let's go white. Let's change the size of it. That looks good right there, okay? And so what you're gonna do for me is you're gonna create 10 slides, okay? So 10 slides. All right. Notice that when I create my slide here, it always has title and all that. So instead of hitting the plus, I'm going to hit this drop down box and I'm going to hit blank instead. OK, so now when I hit the plus, it automatically gives me another blank one. I like to work with the blank ones. OK, this one, I don't like it. Trash it. This one, I don't like it. Trash it. I'm just hitting the delete button on my keyboard. Okay, so now I have blank ones. When I hit the plus button, it gives me another blank one, okay? So I want 10, 10 slides with symmetry on it, okay? Click the wrong thing. 10 slides with symmetry. Now, you can do some simple ones with one line of symmetry. Um, maybe you can find some more complicated ones and draw a horizontal line of symmetry. This bird does not have a horizontal line. If I folded it across here, this tail would not find another tail to match. Um, so this one only has one. Challenge yourself. Find me a, a couple, a, a two out of ten or so, um, and uh, give me something besides just one line of symmetry. Maybe it has a horizontal line. Maybe it has a a, a um, diagonal line. Okay. Maybe it has two diagonal lines of symmetry. Be um, flowers are a good thing to find more than one line of symmetry. Okay. So that's your assignment. Uh, I think I scheduled you 45 minutes to an hour to get this done. Get it done. OK, um, and then you can share it with me. If you have any questions, 
you can't ask me. Okay. Um, now hopefully Miss Hattie will be able to help you. And, uh, and uh, I think this is pretty simple. Okay. All right. Again, guys, I love you. I miss you. I'll see you soon.